I'm going to head outside for a live look over the capital city where there is a new push to get more people to buy homes. Hartford has some of the lowest home ownership rates in our state, but a brand new federal grant could remove some of those barriers. Channel 3 Hartford Bureau Chief A. Galal is breaking it all down for us. I love my home. Uh, that's that's my baby. Delene Falcon has lived in Hartford for about 20 years, and six years ago she became a homeowner. That's my joy, my my gem. I love my home. With the help of the Southside Institutions Neighborhood Alliance, or SINA, Delene was able to purchase her first home in Hartford. And she knows there are a lot of barriers residents of the city face when it comes to home ownership. A lot of times, renters, they get move around, right? They don't have resources. They're trying to get by, so they can't, they don't have a, a solid foundation to help build and to make the changes necessary in the community. The homeowner occupancy rate for Hartford is at about 27 percent. It's very low. It's you know that that puts us as at the lowest owner occupancy in the state and and probably one of the lowest owner occupancy rates of uh, any community in the country. In the Frog Hollow neighborhood, only seven percent of residents are homeowners. In the Northeast neighborhood, 23 percent are. To help promote homeownership in these neighborhoods, the city has received a 1.5 million dollar federal grant. Fund from the grant will be used towards various education and outreach initiatives so that more residents here in Hartford can become homeowners. The grant is funded through the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services and is spread out over three years. We know that it helps increase and uh, the health status of individuals. It also helps increase generational wealth over generations, which has long-lasting effects. In Hartford, Aegonel, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.